Black smoke billowing skyward from wrecked rail cars. This scene in East Palestine, Ohio this weekend. Eerily similar for some in Northeast Wisconsin. Familiar because Wyoiga had a train derailment of its own back in 1996. A train derailment that was so bad that residents had to evacuate for about two weeks. The footage shows the derailment scene in Wyoiga back in 1996. Marietta Pop says she remembers seeing a plume of smoke after the accident and not really knowing what was happening. Firemen said everybody has to leave. We said leave school? No, leave town. <laughs> so they were going up and down the streets and everybody had to leave in a, in a flash and they thought it was for like 20 minutes or a half hour, not realizing it would end up for 16 days. Over 30 rail cars derailed. Many of them were filled with hundreds of thousands of gallons of hazardous material like propane, forcing the evacuations. It was scary because nobody knew what happened to their homes and, and as our school and our church and everything, we were all wondering if we'd ever get back to it. Pop says a train derailment in Ohio brought back memories of what happened in her city back in 1996. <laughs> National attention on a small, close-knit community from a freak accident that residents who lived through it will never forget. Very important for us to go ahead um, as we go ahead to remember the history of the past. Um, and we can learn from it, we can get strength from it, we can get courage from it, and we can learn how to deal with things better. In Wyoiga, Paul Stino, Local 5 News.